Welcome to Keeping Up With Brian's Drinking. Before we get started into this video of keeping track of how many drinks I take in per day, I want to send out a little challenge at the Try Guys. So Eugene, I really want to find out how many you drink a day or a night. I'm just curious because I'm do right when I'm doing this, all I can think about is I want to see other people drinking habits, like real drinking habits, not for the gram, not for anything, right? Just for your daily vlog. Eugene, I hope to see you make a video of this and I will be watching it and liking it because I am a fan of yours. All right guys, so I'm starting this new challenge video where I will be trying to record myself every night before I drink. And when I have a second or third or fourth. So that way we, you can keep track of me cause this guy sometimes doesn't even keep track of himself. I do have a calendar in the studio where I try to write how many beers, how many wine I do drink at night. But as time goes on, I do forget. A week goes by, I won't even remember two, three days ago how many beer or wine I drink. It will help me remember and help you see if I'm an alcoholic or nah. But you know, a couple beers doesn't hurt, right you guys? Every night? <laughs> I'm just kidding. But I don't drink drink every night. I do drink six out of seven. <laughs> but you know, nothing bad, you know, not like trying to get hammered drunk. So here's a rundown from yesterday. I had one glass of wine and three beers, three Corona Extra. It might have been four, but I don't remember if I had four or just three. So, as you can see, this is why I'm going with this option of you keeping track of me. Today is March the 7th. Let's go. All right, guys. So, my very first drink. If you guys look this background here, as you can see, I'm not an alcoholic, okay? That's just been there maybe a couple months ago yesterday <laughs> only the only the wine bottle in the back that's it that was here yesterday i did finish that all right guys from the counter to the studio here we are my girlfriend just uploaded her first ever youtube video by Woo! herself Woo! so it's about makeup if you guys are into it go check her out okay it's still under Corey and brian just a quick update guys still on my first beer it's very cold. I'm thinking about putting a hoodie on right now. How I'm feeling? I'm feeling a little down. I don't know. Just th not energetic. I mean, I think it's gonna put me to sleep. All right, guys. I just got back from the kitchen. Opened me a new second beer, Corona Extra. I'm feel. I'm not feeling sleepy anymore. Comparing to the first beer I had, I was feeling drowsy. I was feeling sleepy. Now I'm like leveling up. Well, it has been a little bit of time for the, from the second one. This is my third one. I did finish the second one kind of fast. I was doing some video editing. Now we're on to the third one. I hope you're still keeping track. I'll see you guys in a minute. All right guys, this is gonna be my last beer of the night. As you can see, I'm down to finishing my third beer. Third. Guys, day two of keeping up with Brian's drinking. So here we are. I just got back home from work. It's been an exhausting day. My feet is hurting, guys, and I just opened myself my first bottle of beer. It's a Sing Tao. It's a very good Chinese beer. Tastes very good. And like I always do, I put it in the freezer right when I got home so that it's extra cold. And I went to shower, got out, and here we are, guys. Beer number one, day two. Slow down, Brian. Day two, second beer. Are you guys still keeping track for me? Watching some poker. So quick update, second beer, that's all. Hey guys, so my girlfriend brought me my third beer. She's supporting the cause. I'm not supporting, the <laughs> I'm not, no. We're on our third beer. I'm on my first. A funny story is that <laughs> she is gonna be getting me beers and stuff whenever I want in, in exchange. I will do her, her tax return. You haven't even done it, so it's like all the waste of time. Once I do her tax return, guess who's not going to be bringing me beer? Nothing. Guys, we are on our fourth beer of the night. Guys, it's Saturday. I'm sadly to inform you, I am drinking. This is my first, first drink. 
so it's an old fashioned. Hopefully, it's just gonna be maybe three more, but. <laughs> Hi guys, so third day of keeping up with Brian's drinking. Today, I only had an old fashioned at the restaurant, and my girlfriend had a little mamacita macarita. Bucarita. And then she got a headache afterwards, so. Right now, I'm still it's contemplating changing. on drinking or not. So far tonight, guys, one drink down, and that's it. So far, so good. What's up, what's up, you guys? It's nighttime, so you know what it is. It's keeping up with Brian's drinking. Here we are, just got off work. It's been a, a tough day today. It's been a good, tough day. So, I'm about to show you what I'll be drinking tonight. We're not we're not skipping tonight, you guys. It's a Sunday. Okay, we're still going with the Sing Tao beer. I think this is my only one left from the six pack that I brought home. I got some member mark 46 ready to go. I'm just like, bring it on. It's time for Brian to drink. I'm trying to figure out my second drink. And I'm I'm trying to open the maker's mark. So here's the maker's mark bottle. I was trying to figure out how to open it and I ripped this little part off from this because I thought you were supposed to yank it off but what I found out is right here this is where you pull you pull you just keep pulling you just keep pulling until you reach around when, if you, went, you just have to twist this up it's hard to do it one hand you guys I'm trying all right guys so check this out when I bought the maker's mark it came with two two beautiful glasses I got it at Sam's I believe I got two of these whiskey glass maker's mark 46 on the bottom of it and I thought it's really cool to show it to you guys because this is my first time ever having Maker's Mark. So, and I've heard great things about it. All right, I just have got some ice in. So I'm just gonna do a countdown, guys. We're gonna do about two shots. If you hear me, but I was counting one, two, three, four. Hopefully that's, that's what it is. That's a shot, <laughs> but I could be wrong. Number two drinks. Cheers. Look at that, that's beautiful. All right, my girlfriend is still here clearing things up. Not an update, you guys. Still on the second drink, but I put my phone on a little tripod so I can move around a little better for you guys. She's putting up that wallpaper with her big booty. And we got that high YouTube. My second drink, this thing, when I took a sip of it, you guys, I feel like in my, inside my system and this thing just set it on fire. It sparked a life inside of me for some reason. It's just like, woo, <laughs> woo. I feel like I was a dragon. I breathed out and it was hot. Maker Smart, if you want to holla at your boy, I can advertise as a dragon for you because I just took another sip and I feel it. I feel it. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh, beer is more like, all right, nice, cold, calm. This thing is like lighting a fire in my booty. Mm. You know, when, when someone try to light their fart and then the flame actually comes out, have you ever done it? No, but I've seen stupid people do it. But I'm not one of them, you guys. I'm not one, one of them. them. Not yet. Guys, okay, so we're just chilling here in my office. In our office. We got a little couch here too. So sit down. You want to be my guest on YouTube? We can both be dragons together. Thanks for your helping. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys. I'm on a supervising duty, right? <sighs> I am supervising to the... 400 extent supervising mode all right we are going for our third drink of the night all right i will need two hands for this sorry about that guys that thing needs two hands these hands right here it needs two of them to open up but yeah guys we're gonna go back to my method counting one two three four as a shot and i'm doing a double so we're gonna double count it I feel like drinking hard liquor is not for me because I cannot stand having any any like water, alcohol in front of me. I would just take a sip and a sip and a sip until it's all gone. Same thing with water. If I just have it in front of me, I can't leave it alone. It's one of those things that I just grab it without knowing. We're three sips away of finishing it. I'm about to reload. Damn. This dragon is about to fly off the chimney and go meet Santa Claus on the roof. Guys. Day five. Drink made. Woo! Guys, I've been sipping this whiskey and man, it's 
it's hitting the right spots. It's just burning sensation, but the good kind. Is there ever a good burning sensation? If there wasn't, <laughs> there is now. Maker's Mark 46. Holla at your boy. All right, guys, we're about to pour ourselves a second drink. The first drink, my girlfriend poured me a shot inside. So I really want to see what's the difference between me counting one, two, three, four versus pouring a whole shot in there. Well, I made a little mess. My counting method wasn't so off. I was counting one, two, three, four to pour the drink. And it looks about similar. Last night drinks were just one shot drinks. I do have a funny story to tell you guys. You know how I've been, I was, I've been talking about Maker's Mark 46. Well, as soon as I started talking about that, right? I pull up on my Facebook account and I, I'm starting to get Maker's Mark sponsor ads by Facebook. Now, that's a little weird and suspicious timing for me. I just talked about this when I got home. And then 10, 15 minutes later, I scrolled down the Facebook post. I found the Maker's Mark ad. I don't know, guys. I don't know. All right, guys, we're going for our third drink of the night. She is you supporting the cause. No, it's a bribe. <laughs> All right, guys, day five, third drink of the night. Finish with the third one. I'm about to go pour me a fourth drink of the night. Hopefully there won't be a fifth, right? All right, fourth one of the night, you guys. If you don't hear from me after this, then I'm probably going to go to bed pretty soon. Like, I don't, I don't do it on purpose, but when I'm tired, I'm ready to go to bed. I just go. I'm not going to grab my phone and record and be like, I'm ready to go to bed. No, I'm actually just going right, to go to bed. Day six, my girlfriend is supporting the cost this time. She is making our drink. So we're... It's for us. <laughs> It's for us, that's right. But my day six of keeping up with Brian's drinking. We, we got some fresh orange juice with some Tito's vodka. We're gonna screw this up and make it a driver, you guys. <laughs> Screwdriver that is. Now I wanna see her shake, shake that booty. Shake, shake, shake that booty. She's not ready. <laughs> oh, right. come on bartender. Oh, what you got? You need some Cardi B music? <laughs> No. That's all the shake I get. Girl, the Laffy Taffy get more shake than that. Check that Laffy Taffy. That Laffy Taffy. Hey guys, at least you're doing one thing right, right? Smiling while she's shaking. You have to smile yeah, when you shake. Yeah, there's a creep ordering, staring at your ass and complimenting how he would wish he was young. Ooh, so let's go to Hooters. Do you want with ice? I love it with us. Oh, no, no, no. I think it's cold enough because I like mine shaken, not stirred. Ooh. All right. <laughs> Guys, she put like 10 shots in here for me. Are we considering this one drink? Ooh, mama. This is mine. That's yours? Mm hmm But this is keeping up with Brian's drinking. It's for me with eyes. Are you jealous yet? No. I'm just happy you made me a drink. <laughs> All the six days, you guys, you've been telling me, don't drink, because don't drink too for much. Me. I, did it. I didn't mean it for you, I did it for us. You're gonna get one more? Don't do it. Don't get one more. Guess who got two more after that? All right, cheer, guys. Four shots, two drinks, one Brian. That's all. All right, guys, coming home, I was craving something cold. So we're on to day six, and I'm having myself a screwdriver. Courtesy of, of my girlfriend. She's supporting the cause, guys. She's one foot in the door of supporting the cause of keeping up with Brian's drinking. <laughs> so here we are. We got a little screwdriver going on. I haven't had this since, man, in college days when I go out on Sundays to go watch the football games. I always order screwdrivers with the buddies. So this kind of bring back a little I bit of memories. Wow, guys, these screwdrivers are hitting the spot. I prefer my girl girlfriend's drink, though, because it has ice in it. Mine got a little bit warm already, so I'm going to sip some of hers and steal yeah. her ice. I'm going to steal her thunder. But yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know this thing is hitting all the right spot. Oh, man. Fresh out the shower, you guys. We're about to go ham on this. How many shots you put in here, babe? Was it two? Was it three? Three. 
three shots, guys. So four divided by two plus three. Drink number two, you guys. All that math, you guys must be confused. I'm pretty good with math, actually. So that Asian stereotype, huh, I worked on it. I got it. She don't got any of that Asian sensation going on, guys. The Maybe numbers, the, Asian. the numbers is mumbo jumbo to the mumbo to her. Shaken, not stirred, please. What's your name? James. James Bond. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. That's not his string. Corey and Brian. Feeling good, living better, you guys. Man, I'm turning up tonight. I don't even know what's going on, but after having one glass of these before going and taking a shower, I'm feeling good. I'm living good. I'm feeling even better right now. Guys, it's Tuesday, so you know what time it is. We're gonna have to club going up on a Tuesday, you guys. The club is AKA my house. My third drink of the night. All right, guys, you know what time it is. It's nighttime. It's trying to keep up with Brian's drinking. Saturday is one of my least drinking days. I only had an old fashioned that day. Drink number one. One, two, three, four, five, six. So that's about one and a half shot, right? If we go, if we're going by my methods, I counted to six. Look at that. First drink of day seven, you guys. Let's get it. All right, your boy just got a shower, guys. And you know what time it is. Drink number two, day seven, guys. It's been a whole week of you keeping up with me. Hopefully we learn a thing or two that Brian is not an alcoholic. Right, guys? Drink number two of you keeping up with more. <laughs> day seven it is, you guys. I can't believe it's been a whole week of you keeping up with me. Wow, day seven. I cannot believe that slipped up. I'm gonna have a hangover tomorrow or something. I don't know. I might just pour one more for Corey. I'm drinking for Corey and myself. Did you wash your hands? I know whiskey kill all the, the bad things, but... but I Look, my hands <laughs> No, no, no. It was full, you guys. Day seven. Look what I have left. I'm crippled. I'm about to load up. Guys, bring on the big guns. Right now, how I'm feeling? I'm feeling great. I'm feeling oh, better than A-OK. -okay. I'm feeling like something is firing me up. I think it's a whiskey. I started a bonfire inside me, and no one else is enjoying it besides me. Because I'm the only one that can feel it. Can you picture that? Having a bonfire, right? But it's inside you. No one is invited to go inside you to have a little marshmallow, a little s'mores. It's just me by myself, guys. And I'm here happy. Other people are not happy. So what, what did I say to them? I'm like, I'm having a great time. That's what I'm trying to tell them.